the city wanted to do a fun, happy project that was COVID related. I, I just wanted something happy around town. Sarah Frances Hardy and I write and illustrate children's books. I do a little bit of everything. I, 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 do, I do paintings, I do fine art that are landscapes, bright colors, but lately I have switched to doing a lot of my artwork digitally. I am a graphic designer and a painter and um, do all sorts of art, but I very rarely hand draw anything anymore. Earl Dismuke, who um, is the artist that was talked about it with the mayor and asked me if I would be a part of an art project for the city. It's a way we could get some public art out there without having to spend too much money, something that could lift spirits in these kind of weird times, and um, something that would be really visible. I really wanted to do something that wasn't graphic. Um, so I started doodling and when I doodle I usually doodle like these oyster shapes and so I uh, went with all this big panel of um, oyster doodles and then with the um, text the world is your oyster. You can sit in the bus stop and you can have your picture made with it and you don't get anything on your clothes and so it, it's um, it, it became a little bit more permanent. They look clean and professional, but you know, a lot of bang for your buck. The people that are on the bus stop are their little kids and they're wearing masks and they say mask up. I made stickers out of them and all of that. I wanted to play with their look and their outfits. I had a really good time. I just wanted to represent everybody and um, create a group of kids that look like the kids walking around Oxford. Mainly, I just, uh, I strive to be expressive and authentic in my artwork, and I hope it would encourage people to draw and to, to do little projects like this. Art was always my first love and what I went back to, so now I get to do what I love. I hope it just will put a smile on people's faces behind their masks, of course, but, um, and also it just, it does send a message, like, wear your mask. I would love to see people post pictures with their favorite one. We do have some money budgeted this next year for public art. Um, there's nothing I can announce yet, but we do take it seriously, and so there, there will be some cool things coming in the next, you know, six months or so.